Alrighty, so this implementation was built out by Lucas, uh, one of our consultants here at Zenata. Um, so this is automated QR code generation for trade show specific lead forms. Um, it's a mouthful, but it's actually functionally, you know, pretty straightforward what we're looking to do here. Um, essentially, there's a client that, um, you know, goes to many different trade shows and wants a way to generate leads and know that those leads came from those trade shows. Um, as you know, or, you know, if people aren't familiar with kind of how the marketing space works around trade shows, you really want to make sure it's worth going, right? You might have different trade shows run by different groups that serve different customers, and some of them might be driving great leads for you, some of them might not. So it's really important if you're going to pony up, you know, flights, hotels, meals, the expense of going to one, um, that you're getting good leads from it. And so in this case, the real goal here was to make it so that someone can walk up to the booth, scan a QR code, fill out a quick form, and then we know they're a lead from this particular trade show. Um, so what we did, essentially, build out a lead capture form inside of Zoho Creator. Um, we used Creator because there are a couple little custom things we wanted to do while the user was filling it out that we couldn't do inside of Zoho Forms. But you could do a very similar thing here with Zoho Forms. Um, the Creator was kind of unique to this very specific use case. Um, then we set up a module in CRM where the client can load trade shows that they're going to do um, and provide which lead source they would like for that particular trade show. Uh, example being, maybe you have a certain type of trade show that happens once a quarter and you want all the leads to come in as one lead source. So you know if that like quarterly tradition is worth it. Um, next, uh, in that trade show module, create a custom button where once they fill out which lead source they want, the name of the trade show, kind of the relevant information, uh, they can press a button, a script will run that will use a third party API um, to create a QR code that points to that lead capture form, but pre-fills information specific to that trade show. So essentially each trade show automatically gets its own QR code. Um, then we store that QR code as the record image. So it's just easy to find. We could really store it anywhere if you want to in work drive, record image, file upload field, you know. Uh, in this case, the image was just the easiest place for the customer to always know where to look, right? Top left, click there, boom, QR code. Um, then once that user submits the form, they're created as lead. They've got the proper lead source. They can even be connected to that trade show record if you want to attribute that directly um, with like a lookup field. And the rest of the process can be tracked knowing that a particular lead came through that individual trade show. So really nice one here. I mean, at the end of the day, like there's a lot of different paths you could take to get this done. Again, you don't inherently need to do this with creator is kind of unique for this client. Um, but pretty straightforward path to create a variety of QR codes all dynamically, automatically um, that point you to very specific forms to land on. Wow. That is a very, very nice implementation. Is this what happens when a developer becomes a consultant? They just go crazy. They do it all themselves. Pretty much. They, they, they Pretty visualize much. it, create it, it. It all happens there. Nice job, uh, Lucas and your invisible friend. Very, very